हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो क्वेश्चन इज रुपीज सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड इन्वेस्टेड एट टेन परसेंट पर एनम कम्पाउंडेड एस एम ई एनुअली अमाउंट टू रुपीज एटीन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी टू फाइंड ए टाइम पीरियड ऑफ द इन्वेस्टमेंट सो दिस क्वेश्चन सॉल्व दिस सो फर्स्ट एंड ऑल इन्फॉर्मेशन डेट है गिवन प्रिंसिपल इज इक्वल टू रुपीज सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड एज गिवन द रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट इज गिवन टेन परसेंट पर एनम So 10% per annum means semi annually. That means we have to express this rate in terms of six months. So divided by two, 10 divided by two, it will become five. So for this question, five percent will be our rate of interest. The time, it is unknown. But though it is unknown, but um, if we take it as n, so in the seven it is semi annually. So we usually multiply the time by two. So here also. n into two it will become that is equal to two n, and the amount is equal to rupees one eight five two two. So for this question, principal is equal to sixteen thousand. Rate of interest will be five percent. Time will be two n, and the amount will be eighteen thousand five hundred twenty two. So therefore, write down our equal formula that is principal into one plus rate by hundred to the power n is equal to one. The amount. So I put down the values. Principal is one six zero 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 into one plus rate is our five by hundred to the power n means to the power two n is equal to the amount that is one eight five two two. So first of all, take this number to this side. So as it is in multiplication here, it will go for division here. So before writing the numbers, we solve the inside portion of the bracket. Hundred. So the hundred as the LCM, hundred plus five to the power two n is equal to now one eight five two two by this number now that is one six zero zero zero. So find it becomes one hundred five by hundred to the power two n is equal to one eight five two two one six zero zero zero. So I cut one hundred five and hundred by five becomes twenty one. And it becomes twenty. So it becomes twenty one by twenty to the power two n is equal to one eight five two two by one six zero zero zero. And decide this one eight five two two by one six zero zero zero. We cut by two first. So if we will not cut by two, we cannot find out the square. So it becomes nine two six one up and eight thousand down. So now directly we can do that is twenty one by twenty to the power two n is equal to so now this ninety nine to six one we have to express in terms of uh, ex exponential form where twenty one will be the base so for this we have to multiply twenty one into twenty one you know, like this until it comes nine to six one so twenty one into twenty one one two two ones are two 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 are four 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 one So four hundred forty-one again by twenty-one. So one four four. Two answer two eight eight. We come nine two six one. So nine two six one nine two six one come. So this twenty-one this twenty-one two twenty-one. There are two twenty-one and again another twenty-one here. That means or total three twenty-one. So that means twenty-one to the power three is equal to this nine two six one. So twenty-one to the by twenty to the powers three. Will be equal to nine nine to six one by eight thousand. So now here it is two and here here it is three. So we can cut the bases. So I cut this one base and this cut base. So now remains two n is equal to three. So here n will be equal to so multiplication it will become division here three by two. So three by two you cut it one point five is equal to one point five years. So you not write one point five years there. You directly write here time is equal to one year, six months, or simply one point five years. So both this can be the answer. So this is the final answer for this question. So guys, thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solution.